Mike, come and on. Three, two, one. And we're, we're live. live. <laughs> Welcome to Lame Dudes Podcast, the podcast <laughs> with lame dudes and even lamer questions. What? Uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> That's the new show? We're doing yeah. a full rebrand? We have questions now? We're doing you know, a full rebrand. If you're one of four people who actually watch the show and don't interview. find us through random YouTube searches, uh, <laughs> write write a question down in the comments. Give us a question. We're going to answer it. We have this all week, the answers for you. We would love questions. This week we're answering the question, uh, why does my PP come out yellow? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, dude, did you check? Dude, how many you likes did we get on the last video? And then we asked for a lot of likes. Did they smash the like button? Uh, Pretty sure we got at least six, nine. Let's check. Oh. I bet we got about Cheers. three. Hell yeah. This is huge. Thanks. I, I swear we that there's about, three of us. I bet. Um, Wait a minute. So, <laughs> actually, here, I'll look it up right now. We're checking the last pod. We're checking the last pod in audio and YouTube. Thanks for tuning in, folks. <clears throat> um, it's number 29. Share it with your friends, please. We're almost to thirty again. I've Don't said it last tell time, them our true identities, closer. so I can like still be employed. But you know, <laughs> it really feels official now that we're on iTunes, dude. I mean, like, it's a real podcast. We now. made we're it real. big, dude. It's it, a real one now, with my stupid name on it. Five, five, five. <laughs> <laughs> Zach, really? It says like it says Zach Landry below on the podcast. I noticed that, dude. How long until you get oh. an IMDb page? So dude. the furry episode is that what you guys <laughs> are asking about? Yeah, it's we, uh, yeah. zero comments, three likes. One of the Hell likes yeah. is me, we and one it. of the likes is my podcast account. <laughs> oh, dude, then that means one of the likes is on me. <laughs> so we liked our own video, and that's it. Yo, shout out to the audience. Smash like if you're listening. <laughs> that's so fucking funny. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Successful podcast. Yo, remember like the I other day we were like, yo, were you. when we're podcast famous. <laughs> That's great. No, nobody is <laughs> listening to our podcast anymore. One of them's me. One of them's my podcast account. As soon as he said that, I was devastated because I knew I was the last yeah, one. Yeah, so usually what I do is when it gets uploaded and it says it's processing, you can click the continue link to like look at it while it's processing. So yeah. I like click that and then I like copy it, drop a like real quick. Yeah. And I log out. He and drops the like I look for it on. my subscriptions bo- box on my own uh, YouTube account and then right. I smash like there. You smash the like. <laughs> you smash, you smash like. the like so fast. I smash fast. like. That's crazy. Uh, so all time, we have 34 plays with four episodes on Anchor. Um, on the wow. Anchor. The 6 9 episode was really successful, and we need to keep using buzzwords. Like 6 okay. 9 The 6 Love 9 six-nine. the episode where it has 6 9 at the very beginning. Um, we shouldn't be discussing like, our tactics to get it has you. 15, no, we're real. It has 15 plays, minor flex. Okay. But the new one only has nine. Minor flex. So we need to do some kind of a reoccurring 6-9 segment, right? We do already. Takashi Watch. Takashi Watch, Watch, man. What's he up to these days? Oh, well, he dropped I'm just seeing funny memes. I guess we already talked about his new song, I think, actually. I was wondering if you guys could Stupid. help me with something. What? Because, um, so here's the thing with the new 6-9 song is that um, I listened to it for, like, hours on end. On absolute repeat. Um like completely on repeat for like days on end and oh i can't God. stop and i like i have trouble stopping and it's like <laughs> when does bobby not say hold on hold on bring that shit back at the end <laughs> because every time he says it i bring that shit back and i play it again you you're what waiting you you're do, waiting dude? for him to call me listening to it does. you're in a for fucking weeks. loop bro <laughs> <laughs> yeah. this is your life now all right, all right. Bobby Shmurda's controlling you from Free Bobby. <laughs> Free Bobby. 2020, right? He's in your head, dude. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, he's like, hold on, hold on, bring that shit back. I'm like, oh, fuck, all right. Oh, you got it, Bobby. Dude, carve Shmurda into your head. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that'd be a good idea. Shmurda. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone will understand <laughs> who you're fucking fighting for. <laughs> so what? So what's that make? Some six Shmurda. Nine, dude, 12 on the charts? I think it's like 10 or something. Ten, only 10. Come on. 10 for 10. Nine out ten of nine, ten. baby. I got 10 coming out pretty soon. Check it out. Stupid. Stupid. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Love 6 9 man. Shout out to him, bro. Shout out to 6 9 We'll definitely That's just... Takashi Watch. Um, I'm being brainwashed by <laughs> Shmurda. Shmurda's um, brainwashing you, dude. Uh, yeah, so let's move on. 
Uh, Yo, so popping in the news is uh, is that Pete Davidson shit? <laughs> Finally, with, uh, I've been waiting to talk about this for like months. I know, honestly. I got right to it for you, dude. I, okay. it's, it's been sitting on this fucking document for ages. All right, here's um, a but quick. There's finally outtake. some breaking news with the with the Pete Davidson Ariana Grande shit. There. Yeah, give us the news. <laughs> good, good. Uh, breaking news. It's news a, watch. Can't believe it happened, but they're splitting up. Um, breaking off the engagement. Wait, you mean boys. they canceled their engagement? That wait, like, you mean wait, you mean these? They just like randomly announced. These people who've been dating for to be a few months are, as shit? are not getting married anymore. What? Oh, wait. Did, were you like way in on it? You knew this was coming. Oh come on. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, either way, even if they got married, dude, it's gonna go down. Okay. Well, I could believe sure. that, but you could, I didn't know that this was coming. I didn't expect it. I didn't even necessarily expect the wedding. I, I thought they'd actually get married, frankly. Yeah. I thought it'd go down. You thought? Didn't even get there. No. Didn't even get there. That's um, crazy. Shout out to him, though. Good. <laughs> Making decisions, you know, you got to do it. <laughs> That's probably for the best, saving some money. But, um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Zach's got some hot takes on Pete Davidson. He's I'm just so right, fucking tired of seeing Pete Davidson everywhere <laughs> he's so fucking annoying he's not really funny sex not a fan dude. um and people on twitter do not shut up about him what do they say oh he's like pete davidson this pete davidson that and they're like oh, i don't get why I, he's I guess like it's... oh pete davidson's so humble and it's like a video of pete davidson <laughs> on like fucking howard stern and he's like yeah, I don't like to talk about my personal life, like my dating life, but me and Ariana Grande are blah, 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 blah. And I'll just like, and I'm like, wow, that's so cute. It's like, shut the <laughs> fuck up. I don't care. And now like Pete Davidson is just always in like my recommended and shit. Just. Are you serious? Sounds like you're just clicking on this shit, dude. I don't know what to tell you. You're getting, you're, you're like, I watched I mean, the I've whole clicked, video about it. I've and, clicked like, a couple so of Pete Davidson it. links, but it's just so trendy. I mean, I that, yeah, but I've now people to... are going to be bored with him and they're going to be like, yeah, he actually really wasn't that interesting. It's over for him. <laughs> yeah. That's for I sure. thought he was pretty funny with his stand up. I watched some of his stand up and made me laugh. I heard he's got a huge I just dong. don't all of a sudden. <laughs> <laughs> I just don't get, I guess when he got with Ariana Grande, it became like he was all like, it became such a big deal. It became like they were such, uh, iconic couple or whatever and then it, I, that's when it kind of got annoying for me dude it's like what the who, why is everyone rip mac dude yeah the, the, OG, rip mac. the og iconic is that why though <laughs> ariana do you think that has something to BF? do with um didn't she like i was reading she like tweeted something or some shit the other day where she's just like i've just had such a bad year or something i don't know so i mean she pr- bad yeah, year, dude. She that really probably bad year. like what are you talking about yeah bad year, mate. that probably like strained on her yeah in some way that's brutal when did that um when did that thing at her concert happen was that last year or this year what thing what 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 happened zach wasn't there some, I f- there was a, like a there was some sort of attack or some sort of a situation at one of her concerts no or way. a fan died or a, i can't remember what actually what oh happened. um the shooting in manchester yeah 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 yeah. You oh. remember that? it was, was at it her concert didn't like 25 was it a shooting or a, i don't remember i don't remember there's too many terror was that attacks this year or last do you guys remember that? Oh, that's crazy. That was like not that long ago, but I totally yeah. forgot about it. Yeah, that sucked. <laughs> totally forgot, dude. Insane. Do you know Pete Davidson, Zach Jackson? No. You don't even know? I mean, no. I like I've heard his name, but I don't know anything about him. He's like a he's a comedian on SNL, and that's kind of that's about it. <laughs> look up look up a picture of him. He just looks dead <laughs> behind his eyes. <laughs> I I saw on someone refer to him as a scum bro. <laughs> Yikes. That's and then mean. they define <laughs> sc- <laughs> they define scumbro as someone who's like edgy and doesn't and and like a shower is optional. <laughs> <laughs> it's like it's like know, crusty kind of a little crusty. Yeah, yeah. Scumbro, bro. I like it. <laughs> Scum gang. That's Scum funny. Scum gang. Troy Scum Shiver. gang. That's another six. Yeah, nine the best shout out six nine thing of all time. I love that. We've talked about Treyway before, but I'm pretty like I, you had to explain what Treyway was to me, Jackson, because I actually didn't know. So is Treyway the new Scum Gang? I was gonna ask, is Treyway the new Goth Boy Click? <laughs> <laughs> it's like part of the gang, though, right? It has to do with has to do with like the Bloods or something. It's like a sub. I don't know. <laughs> A yeah, sub- do you want to break it down as like a do sub- you know J- I don't know how it works. works. <laughs> You're not woke about this. Yeah. I thought you Last might know. time I checked, six nine was like, I'm with both gangs. <laughs> Look at my colors, dog. That's nice of him. Yeah, he was like wants to be buddies. Dude, I thought he had a, a red flag hanging on his backside. Yeah, that's the thing. It seems like he's actually a blood. Only he also on, says blood on the right all the time. side. <laughs> he's like blood. 
<laughs> he's like, I thought he was blood. Is he crip? <laughs> he's like, I'll call you blood, but I'll still use words that start with C. I'm confused. And that's my oh. neutral stance. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so confused. I thought he was blood all along. I mean, if you if you just watch his videos, he seems heavily blood f- <laughs> favored. He loves the blood. Dude. When six nine goes to McDonald's, they go, "What kind of drink do you want, sir?" He goes, "A boba bola." Because <laughs> oh, <God>. <laughs> I'm a blood. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> I said one boba bola. Oh, I'm clipping the fucking audio. They're like, uh, "Come again." Sack right now using uh the mixer as a coaster for his what is it what are we, I let my edgy. drink rest edgy. what I are we it. drinking on here I let my this drink is, uh, rest apple green apple flavored crown royal right? oh yeah it is wow kind of tasty I'm glad you like it dude I don't actually love it <laughs> glad it's gone it's actually hard <laughs> to can drink. I have yours drive home hammered yeah I'm actually you gotta be you gotta be sober <laughs> I'm kidding drive home hammered <laughs> not safe <laughs> Jack's got to take you home and shit oh yeah. Yeah, I definitely shouldn't drink more after that bong rip. The BRs. I've only had half a drink so far, for the record. Like, no one called no, the you're cops. Fine. You're no fine. one called the feds on me. You're, if you're, f- you're perfectly fine, dude. Don't if you're listening, smash that 911 and call <laughs> the feds. Dude, <laughs> what is this you wrote about Pete Davidson and they has butthole eyes? <laughs> yeah, that was the eyeball thing. People were referring to it as butthole eyes, but I think he just looks dead in the butthole. eyes. <laughs> like, he, there's just, like, pictures of him candid, but then, like... You're like, wait, is this a wax figure? Because you look in his eyes and you're like, there's no life. Is this a wax figure? <laughs> there's not. I don't know what it is. At one point, I love um, it. at one point, like Ariana Grande was like, guys, he doesn't have butthole eyes. Like he has oh like my God, really? he has they like so and so disease or something. But then someone who was like a doctor like replied and was like, yeah, I'm a doctor and that's not a symptom. Like oh he just God. has really dark eyes. That's so funny. <laughs> <laughs> that's not a symptom. They're like, yeah, that's not a real thing. I like, it's like, guys, stop calling him butthole eyes. <laughs> There's no way. She it was actually funny. kind of funny. Did she actually tweet? Did 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 she? Well, type it was like a eyes? like woke girl type tweet where I was like, tired of people being a dick to my boyfriend about his butthole eyes because it's because he has like <laughs> <laughs> anemia or like some shit like that. Dude, no matter what, that so, sounds like woke ridiculous. people were like, yeah, Pete Davidson doesn't have butthole eyes <laughs> for like a week, oh, and it was like, man. it's just a meme. Like, relax. <laughs> no one thinks less of Pete wow. Davidson because of his butthole eyes. Because of his butthole eyes. It's just a little um, meme. Uh, I'm sure he's a nice. You dude. can't tread <laughs> on these butthole eyes, man. You absolutely can't. That's so funny. The ring he got Ariana Grande was huge. Really huge. Yeah. What, what do you think they did with it? Like his D. Um, he probably sold that? it, and then he got <laughs> it, all the money back in cash, and he was like, "Bitch, I'm silly." <laughs> 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 and he went to like the casino. Did he just text you this or something? <laughs> yeah, I'm hanging out with Pete later. I hope he doesn't hear this podcast, dude. It's got to be. Worth, doesn't hear me shit on him really more after this incident, dude. Like the ring. Yeah, you sell the ring on eBay. Oh, though. I wonder if that's a thing. Like official famous divorce couple rings. Oh my gosh! It's you imagine that must be a market. Finger, d- finger, dude. It's been on that finger, bro. Like you somehow like there's finger of- sweat. <laughs> there's finger debris. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's goddamn money in the bank, boys. That's money in the bank. Dude. You can like clone the person who wore the ring. Yeah, there's just uh, wait, what? Just a Whoa. little bit of like skin cell in there, and they like clone it of like stem cells. What are you gonna make a make a grande? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> My wife. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't uh, initially going there, but then I was like, all right, I can yeah, go. Yeah, I, I was surprised you made that leap. I was just going to say, like, you can just clone someone <laughs> Dude, with the skin you, cells. You, wish. <laughs> you can't just clone people. Yeah, you can, because I say so. Because <laughs> I have one. I built it. I have a clone. I've made a few people. <laughs> Hide it in my box spring in my mattress. <laughs> you lift it up. It's to get just a hollow like a, space. a cut out of a... Some weird device that you've made. It's just a sex blow up doll. (laughs) You're like, yeah, that's not a real clone. I'm like, ah, this is my clone. (laughs) It was like cum all over it. (laughs) Like you fuck a clone of yourself. Yeah, yeah, I do. So far, you're like, yeah, I can only make one of me, so (laughs) I just fuck it. (laughs) Okay. (laughs) Jackson. So the weather really changing (laughs) outside lately. Oh, yeah. I went for a hike yesterday with my sex doll. (laughs) (laughs) Sorry, I'll stop with the sex doll jokes. (laughs) I just don't know how we got there. Yeah, I don't know either. 
I love it. Descend it quickly. I was going to ask you guys a weird question, but I don't want to. You don't want to drop it now? I'm scared to drop it, dude. Jackson. Jackson Would I good. fuck a lifelike sex AI? <laughs> no. Was yes. that the question? <laughs> That was totally the question. <laughs> you asked yourself the question. Like Detroit become human level AI? Why not? It's real. Is that like the Telltale type <laughs> game? Yeah. <laughs> uh, why do the sickest games always have that lame ass like gameplay? <laughs> I know, to actually it's play a game. It's so boring. That one was a little bit different from like a full Telltale. Like there was like walking and shit, but it was kind of a walking simulator. Rip tell- Telltale. Love those walking simulators. Yeah, Rip Telltale. Dead. It's crazy because, like, yeah. they were Why? so Canceled. popular. I can't believe they actually went out of business. It's amazing because after they closed, everybody said the exact same thing. Oh, I bought Walking Dead Season 1, and I thought it was one of the best games I played that year. Wow. And then I just didn't buy any other games. <laughs> yeah, like, I didn't even think The Walking Dead was that interesting to, to look at. Like, they're the just kind of making one, decisions and shit. I, I it played was, it. It was like good. like, fuck that, dude. Too hard. I was the was story good. really good? Is that why people liked it? Yeah, I was like, uh, I think um, Glenn... Like makes a cameo, and like leaves. Glenn, thank God, your boy Glenn. Yeah. What cameo in that fucking game? Um, I think it's Glenn. I don't remember, but um, <laughs> could be anybody. And I think maybe Norman Reedus. Norman Reedus. Wait, which one's Glenn? isn't it? Glenn, the Asian dude, right? Yeah, he's right. I I don't <laughs> I haven't watched that show in actually quite a few years. Right? Is that his name? Yeah. Okay. No, you're right. Um, and then there's Rick and Lori and Carl. I know those guys. Is but, Carl uh, the kid? That's the main. I'm so I'm so over zombie stuff to be honest. Yeah, it really killed the trend. Just that show in general, and just yeah. ruined zombies. It also for me. created a, a huge wave of just fucking fuckery, dude. A are, lot of shit. Our our game our games about zombies done. Are we not gonna get definitely anymore? not done? I thought I heard knocking. <laughs> no, you're good. Might be just the chair creaking. It might have been my chair. <laughs> um. Oh yeah, that's what it is. Yeah. I'm like, yo, um, what the fuck? Sorry, <laughs> sorry fam. <at> home. <laughs> Scared as fuck. No, nah, they can't um, hear it. I'm sure they can. <laughs> oh, it might be loud enough. I don't know. J- if Jackson can hear it while we're playing I'll put, games, I'll put my mic right next to you. <laughs> um, what was that? What were we talking about? Zombies, zombie zombie game. games being dead. Are they? Are they? Dead? Telltale. They're dead? probably gonna keep coming out. Zombie games in general. Yeah, for sure. Um, They're so, so easy to do. The new Black Ops Four game mode, Blackout. Which is just Battle Royale. Battle Royale. That's um, what they call it, Blackout? Yeah. Um, and it has Black Ops, old Black Ops maps within the Battle Royale map itself. Oh, it's like you, cool. you run up to them and they're then not, it's the map? Yeah, cool. they're not really like the good maps though. You know what I mean? Like they have like the um, the shipping docks or whatever with like the shipping containers. Didn't know that was a fan favorite. <laughs> um, I know. Like have the, what about the one from Black Ops 1 where it's like, uh, it might be called Summit. I love it's Summit, like the dude. snow base. Yeah, yeah so I good. I mean, ha- I mean, do we want to run from climate to climate? I guess though, make it snowy and one. Yeah, you make could. it work. You could. Yeah, who, you could. Who cares, right? But like, it's really popular. But what they have is there's random areas that have zombies, and there's a mystery box in those areas, and okay. um, the zombies drop like good gear. That sounds pretty fun. It's really cool. Have it's you actually played really it? cool. Um, no, I'm probably not gonna get it. Um, probably just gonna buy. Maybe Pokemon, but definitely Smash 5. Pokemon? That's pretty much all that's on my list. You're wow. going to buy that Pokemon shit? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> isn't it's it a, uh, it's it like... a first-party Nintendo game, so I might as well. Oh, my God. So, so it's like the one where you just follow Pikachu around, right? Yep. Pikachu follows you around. But oh. Like, you just play through like the OG Pokemon game, basically. I the think. OG. Dude, I you think should get the EV different. one just to fuck with people. <laughs> it just Wait, it's not. Off. It's it's fuck just like pe- a normal fuck po- Pokemon game. Um, yeah, I don't really know all the details, but it's not like a traditional. It's actually like I'm just gonna game. buy it, figure it out. <laughs> yeah, See, when it's you... similar. But... Have you been disappointed with any Switch games? Uh, yeah, I bought um Captain Toad's Treasure Tracker, and I was mad about that. I I've, I've never heard of that shit in my life. You're not missing anything. <laughs> <laughs> he was really harsh on that game. Do you remember this happening, Jason? Basically a fucking like iPod he touch said, yeah, game. Yeah, he said it was like a little kid's game. <laughs> <laughs> this like shit's on, for little kids, man. My daddy buys me Treasure Tracker to play on my iPad. That's I know his game. credit card numbers. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, Jackson, do you ever play the Switch? Absolutely not. I never, I, I can't I, I played some like... Uh, Mario Kart and shit. What's but. your what's your overall opinion and review of the Switch? Uh, okay, my critique. Oh, that one for Smash Five. 
No, I'm not gonna play Smash Five that much. I think I mean I'll play it, but probably not enough to buy a Switch. Damn. My but what the reason I don't vibe with the Switch is that I don't like that it's like also a mobile console. Mm-hmm. Like I it's weird. I don't. It's weird, but I feel like I'm missing out on gaming potential <laughs> for whatever that's worth because it's like also also mobile. Mm-hmm. Like I'll never play. Yeah, I mean, I'll literally. never play it not at home. So. I'd rather just play something that I can just like always have a home if that makes I sense. I feel you, dude. Yeah. So I play the PC. 100% agree. Love the PC, dude. PC boys. I'm just not a mobile gamer, dude. Not a mobile gamer. Yeah, I'd always rather be. I always look forward to coming home, you know what I mean? That home base <laughs> type shit. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Exactly. What else we Classic got on the list nerds. here, boys? Oh. The anchor plays are booming. The food, the who? Um, oh, I saw uh, Venom a couple weeks ago, and I Did you meant to it? talk about it last week. I didn't know you saw it, it's dude. You got to give the official review. You're not missing much, folks. Netflix it. Hope it's on Netflix because it's not even dude, worth. We're gonna the have red to box. wait like 1.5 wow. years for that. <laughs> I want to see it now. Damn, <laughs> it's not good. Not that good. It was stupid. I've heard some bad things. The about acting about was Venom. so bad. Really? How like, was Tom Hardy in it? Is Tom Hardy the guy who plays Venom? Yeah. He literally has never acted before. No way, dude. dude. Are you joking? Dude. It was like he was reading it off like big signs painted in like marker. Oh like his my lines. God. That's a hot take. Dude. That's super hot. Hey, how's it going? He's been nominated I'm for shit, I think. Mark or whatever my name <laughs> yeah. is. It's like, damn. This is terrible. So he was the worst part? Yeah, he was really bad. Well, how was Venom? Was Venom funny? I mean, like the action was cool. Yeah. It's a superhero movie, you know, and Venom's a badass, like, villain type deal. Badass. So I heard a lot of people thought it should have been R, and that would have really kind of pushed things to be a little more intense. Yeah, like, please make an adult movie. Yeah, that's the thing, is it was like... Uh, Everybody always says that. <laughs> they never do. <laughs> yeah, Marvel just needs to, like, lay off, like, the, like, comedic relief and stuff. Like, you can yeah. do serious stuff. Like, I don't know. It's annoying. Like, take a movie serious. That'd be dope. Oh, speaking of this Marvel films... Opportunity. So, you know, James Gunn was fired from Guardians Guardians forever. Yeah. 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 Um, so now he's directing Suicide Squad Volume 2. Oh, no shit. He moved to DC Comics. Wow. He's like, yo, fuck Top Marvel. Top 10 comics. I'm fuck these. He's like, yo, Keyed Batman is way cooler. <laughs> True, though. True, actually. So maybe DC movies, like maybe DC will have a hit. That could be that could Suicide be Squad I didn't see two. the first Suicide Squad because it didn't seem bad. worth. Yeah. I mean, Jared Leto as Joker was just so cringe. Was it actually bad? I thought some people liked it. I just didn't want to look at there's him. There's probably some like, fans. I saw, like, so the you, you judged it before you even saw him. There's, like, the promo photos. And there's also, like, those, like, uh, those like articles where he was, like, oh, Jared Leto, like, method acted while he was being Joker. And, like, he did, it's like, sick and twisted <laughs> pranks on all the he cast members. And I was, like, condoms uh, to his cast members. Yeah, and I shit. heard about that. I was, like, like what? Uh, dude? Like, yeah, that's I mean, weird. that's kind of hot. Is that method acting to just... Send cum to your <laughs> in a con. Is that Yo, what Joker does? Dude? Jared Leto mailed me cum. <laughs> I'm pissed. <laughs> <laughs> but also putting this on the internet. <laughs> I'm surprised when like all the actors from uh, from uh, James Gunn's movie like came forward. They all like signed that letter that was like it would like we still want him on the film like they all came forward and signed it didn't matter dude. Wow. they still didn't bring him back they're just <laughs> like nah matter. he's gone yeah i mean what if they all started what if they all started dropping off they probably will right you no think? actually they probably won't they'll probably still do the movie right yeah <laughs> i mean can you imagine though if they if each of the stars of the guardians of the galaxy just said like we won't do the movie if he's not what like do yeah, you maybe think they would just, just do a full the recast? They probably sure, just cancel the movie. But I'm sure like maybe well I'm not sure but their contracts probably say you have to do it to, like regardless of. Yeah, the they might be they might be committed contractually I'm sure, I'm obligated sure at, that, at that point. I'm sure they already are. You know yep. they're definitely deep in a contract, but um, deep in it, man. Damn. No petitioning out here, man. Not in Hollywood. <laughs> <laughs> are you guys up on like? Have you seen the actual Marvel movies? Nah. The actual just, ones. Just um. Venom. <laughs> That's so weird, dude. You're such a nerd. Why don't you watch all the Marvel movies? <laughs> I don't like them. I kinda, I, I've seen a couple. I've seen the earlier ones, You watched like Infinity War and shit? No, nah, I didn't see Infinity War. I even saw Gang. Infinity War. Go see Gang. <laughs> I should. Jax, what, what are your favorite Marvel movies? Uh, Spider-Man 3? 
Wait, that was was that was a Marvel? <laughs> that was before, Isn't it? That was before all that shit. Spider Man Three, you mean like the Tobey Maguire one? Yeah, dude, <laughs> the Tobey. Spider Man Three is on Netflix right that now. Not, I know, it's I watched them so shit. <laughs> or at least it wasn't like MCU. Oh, <laughs> uh, maybe it's. Uh, I think it says Marvel, but because Stan Lee's in I'm, it. No, it's, I'm sure it's Marvel, but it's, but it's probably not, not in that. The no, universe. it's not. <laughs> it's before. Nah. Toby did. Because they have that other dude playing Spider Man. Yeah. Tom Holland, who's very, who's a pretty good Spider-Man. The big Man. TH. The guy before yeah, him wasn't good. good. Tobey Maguire? No, Dude. one in between. The Amazing Spider-Man. Uh, oh. Casey. I don't know. Don't e- I don't even know his name, dude. It doesn't matter. How but is Spider-Man like the most popular superhero? What so the many fuck? Spider-Man so movies, many Spider-Man. dude. So little time. <laughs> it's been like 10 years and there's like six Spider-Man movies. Tobey Maguire was Spider-Man. And then the guy after was like the incredible Spider-Man. It was the Amazing <laughs> Spider-Man. <laughs> was it the Amazing Spider-Man? That's what it's called, yeah. Oh, but he's was... like he's like this buff kid who's not doesn't act like yeah, an actual like Spider-Man. He's a Chad dude. It's like what? <laughs> wow. Why you make us? Sp- Yo, <laughs> okay, I was listening to a Spider-Man podcast. I was listening to a podcast the other day, and they were reviewing the newest episode of Law and Order SVU, and what they were saying was, um, it's an incel episode. Oh. So in the episode, they explain Chad's and Stacy's. What? And like they get confused in the episode and they're like, <laughs> We've been looking up Chads for weeks. We can't find the guy. <laughs> they're like, where are these Chads? They're like going like sequentially <laughs> through the phone book, like, excuse me, are you Chad? Oh my Did you like God. do this thing? And then they realize it's just Chads. Yeah, and then so they what have to twist. Like, they like figure out that a Chad is just like a guy who fucks. <laughs> they're like, like, serious? We were this looking for sick. guys named Chad. We should have been looking for guys who fucked. No, <laughs> we should have been looking for Chad Bros. <laughs> uh, yeah, is this Chad? Yeah. Uh, do you fuck often? <laughs> All right. Sorry, wrong. He's number. like, my name's wrong Chad. Numbers. What do you think? <laughs> of course I do. He's <laughs> like, we got him. <laughs> we got the guy. <laughs> That's awesome, dude. Are they like browsing Reddit when they figure it out? Like they should show like. <laughs> Like I don't wait a minute. Brain this, this user on Reddit says chads are just guys. Who I want to see if I can find it on like Hulu or something and That's watch amazing. it for myself. I'd love to a, just hear the clip. Give a better be really full funny. synopsis. <laughs> what was that? SVU. Yeah, it's SVU. They're still running Law and Order, dude. Wait, is this the SVU? longest running show of all time? Uh, yeah, SVU probably. might be. Fuck yeah. Jesus <laughs> Christ, that shit never ends. I guess what about just NCIS or NYU or USD? Or NYU, dude. W O W. No, no. I don't think there's a lot of uh, I don't think there's a lot of crime shows on right now. I don't know. Dude, is Bones is Bones still on? No, no way, dude. That shit was over like twelve is years Bones ago. Still on? <laughs> Yo, Bones. you guys remember Bones? <laughs> that was the one I watched. <laughs> Yo, do you guys want to ever watch a Monk? Oh, I loved Monk, dude. dude. No, you I know what was, was good was I was such was, a big uh, Monk fan. Yeah. <laughs> Psych. Yeah, yeah. Psych, I, I Psych was, was okay. Psych was that before Psych Monk was shit, so was shitty like, that it was funny. I was like, damn, I can't wait for Psych to be over so Monk will come on. <laughs> Those were like the good old days when like TV was like, I don't know. I, just, I used to be able to enjoy shows like that, but now I just can't do it. It was more fun back then. Yeah. Yeah, I can't watch Monk anymore, dude. Tony I don't Shalhoub. watch a lot of TV shows. Shout out to Tony Shalhoub, though. What have you been watching, dude? Anything? Um, I watched the last two episodes of Dark. On Netflix. on Netflix, how's that? How was that series? I didn't watch any of the other episodes, just the last two. Wait, with, what? With Evan and Liz. Okay, but I'll I got see. the basics How were of the it? last two episodes? It's of pretty dark. cool. It's pretty cool. You like the ending? Yeah, pretty it's good. cool. It's pretty cool. Huh. Hey, shit's cool. It's pretty good. Are you gonna ruin it? What was it? Is it scary? What is it? What's the? It's not right? really scary. It's kind of like spoiler. Stranger Thingsy. It's like a German show, so it's like there's subtitles or there's dubs but the dubs are weird you want to just watch the subtitles mm. okay um because yeah, sub, it's not like a cartoon where the animations aren't like shitty enough like it's in like 4k or some shit so you can see yeah. their mouth moving in high detail so wow. the dub looks really weird and like Wait, disorienting it's, it's not animated <laughs> oh, right it's like just a film yeah it's a live action show yeah um but yeah it's pretty cool it's just like there's like some time traveling bullshit going down yeah. and like I don't know, it's interesting. I thought it was pretty cool. Yeah, but was it cool enough to watch the rest of the series? I don't know. I don't have the attention span to watch any TV shows, so. Mm-hmm. I feel you on that. You should actually check out. There's a lot of new stuff on Netflix. I don't know if you've seen it. There's Malevolent. 
I think it's called. Oh, no, no, no. Uh, what it Malevolent is cool, but I just fucked up the mic. Sorry. Um, but oh, it's okay. I've been fucking with the uh, mic the whole podcast. <laughs> Everybody is. Sorry for the audio but this fans. It's, it's called The Haunting at Hill House, and it's a Netflix series. Hmm. And uh, we're like five episodes in. And it's pretty decent. It's pretty spooky. <laughs> But uh, it's kind of like you're just your 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 scary ghost haunted house type of meme. But um, it's decent. It's worth a watch. I think you'd like it. Is Netflix gonna drop some shit on Halloween again this year? Cause they, I hope didn't so. Didn't they man. do Stranger Things? Last they have year? a show coming. Or no, it's not Netflix. I don't think Stranger. I think Stranger Things is coming out on Christmas this year. Oh, is it? Whack. Whack as fuck. I think I'm, I'm gonna Google it. Look, um, Jamie <laughs> looked that up. Jamie, check this shit out. You guys see Channel Zero, sci-fi? Absolutely. I know not. when you're doing like that scary scary. Dude, what I do you do like scared. this month? Do you like this month of October? Of it just yeah, no, spooky, okay. Spooky? I, I like spookiness as like a meme. So I like when people <laughs> change their profile pic to just have a little like hat. To a jack o' lantern? Yeah, or like a jack o' lantern or a little like witch hat. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. But being as far as being actually scared, no. What's the last scary movie you ever saw, Jax? Okay, well on Twitter today I saw <laughs> Someone retweeted something. I was like, "Huh." I was looking at it. I was like, "This looks really like freaking weird." And then a jump scare came and it spooked it. No, it's like literally somebody like horribly destroyed body from like a car crash. And then Holy I realized shit. what I was looking at. What are you at, watching? I was like, <laughs> "What are you following?" Uh, <laughs> Wait, that doesn't answer my question whatsoever. No, that's the last. Scary. Yeah, that wasn't a that movie. That was the last scary thing I saw. What? What? In movie, a movie though? format. What? The that was a film. A whole movie. What like? Okay. Twitter. At I know. I know what you. I know what you're asking. Um. Never. I don't know. What's the scariest <laughs> movie you've seen? Never. <laughs> what one really fucked with you as a kid? Okay, that's a better question. Like, what sure, fucked yeah. me up as a kid? Yeah. <laughs> what, dude, we could be here for days. Because I'm trying to think about that too. What just deeply <laughs> scarred you? I'm trying to think. I was always really scared of monsters. My dad. For some reason. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> I was like, what movie? "Oh, oh, wait, Monster movies." <laughs> Which part of that? Um, specifically, what scared me as a little kid was um, the like camo monster who was like the bad guy in the oh, movie. Oh, the yeah, the because he movie? had the scariest Monster ability. Zane, you couldn't oh. see him. Oh, Randall, dude, Randall. Yeah, Randall, you and he like would just Randall, blend huh? into shit. Yeah, he freaked me out when I was a little. Damn, okay. baby. I was like, "Yo, that's fucked up." Damn, oh, okay. For me. Not a not a horror movie. I'm sorry to disappoint. Lion King when uh, Mufasa gets trampled by the all the fucking dude. That's that so scared the you. The wils- wildebeest that made me sad. Wildebeest. Dude. It yeah. was so sad. It fucked oh, it was me just up. Sad. Like, yeah, that I, fucked like, me up. Like I, I had to skip that part of the movie. It really <laughs> fucked me up. Like damn. Yeah. I haven't watched Yo, Lion King since. Yo, old Disney dude. movies are fucked up. Like Bambi just gets like murdered They're and like so there's like up. blood in the snow. I think in the movie. Fuck that, dude. I'm not <laughs> watching those goddamn movies, man. Too cheer. Too. Tear jerking, bro. Dude, <laughs> when we goddamn sniffling at the by the end of Bambi, man. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So, do you watch Fox the Nightmare the Before Christmas on Halloween or on Christmas? Because I've never seen that. Uh, every day of the week. <laughs> Great question, dude. Oh, yeah, dude. I think. Aren't you a real Tim Burton meme fan? Nah. Uh, I think He's you should only do a it meme on. Fan. <laughs> He's not a real fan. I actually think it's more of a Christmas movie. Really? Yeah. Interesting. It's just like about spooky people. After I don't know. Halloween. I don't think I'm goth enough to watch that movie. Yeah, you True. are, dude. You just need some eyeliner on while you watch it. Yeah, but and on, some ha- fingerless on Halloween gloves. you might be. Everybody gets everybody's a buff. goth on Halloween. Yeah, everybody dude. gets a buff on Halloween. Yeah, goth goth also, stats it's, it's up. Not, goth it's buff. not that goth, so you'll probably be fine. Got that goth buff. <laughs> <laughs> probably won't be a problem. <laughs> it's like made for your demographic. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I I nice remember meme. I remember watching fucking Nightmare on Elm Street when I was like um like eight or nine. Nightmare on Elm Street. Yeah, with the Freddy Kruegers. Oh yeah, yeah. Was that the? First I saw one that like that a year ago. That didn't really fuck me up. I wasn't too scared by it. I'm trying to think of movies that really got me scared. I didn't like uh I didn't like a s- movies with assault and shit like that. That yeah, bothered me no, mm-hmm. never as a young and don't know why I was watching movies like that, but. <laughs> You always want to watch ballsy stuff when you're a kid, like trying to be an edge lord from yeah, day one, you're, dude. You're always wanting to see the next <laughs> one. dude. I hated when like I was at school and all the fucking kids had seen like this ballsy ass movie I hadn't seen. I was like, fuck. Did that happen to you? Oh yeah, I'm trying to think. Like, 
if looking back, like, oh, it was like Pineapple Express. Like, uh, all the kids that seen Pineapple Express I was like, fuck, I haven't seen that movie. Damn, I yeah, that's see so that. Cool. I was like, that movie must be so cool to watch. I hope I get to watch it one day. I wanted to see <laughs> that movie I watched so it bad on when a it came plane, out, What, like, sitting near my mom? <laughs> <laughs> You're like, damn, mom, this movie's dank, huh? <laughs> yep. Dude, weed. It She's like, sick. blaze it. <laughs> that is a actually a pretty good movie. I like Pineapple no, Express. No, it's, it's quality. It's I, like it. I like it. That, like, era of comedy movies were good. Those Seth wrote, like, well, knocked that w- up and shit. Was that, like, the first, like, really successful one, and then they, like, just copied were it? Were those all Judd Apatow while? movies? Like, Knocked Up was Judd Apatow. Yeah. Superbad, was that Judd Apatow? That was... I, I'm pretty I sure Step Brothers was it. Judd Apatow. Really? Yeah, like, Jesus just Judd Christ, Apatow dude. era, like, comedies was from that out, time bro. were just so sick. What's good, Judd? They wouldn't, the King. They wouldn't last... A st- like, they would just fail immediately now, but... The humor was like just super. Like when you go back and Isn't watch it, you're weird? just like, man, this is like really cringe. Yeah, I, I laughed so hard at Step Brothers the first time I saw <laughs> it. Rubbing dude. my balls on his drum set, like just shit like that. That's such like, a good point. Is it because we're older, or has like the whole culture changed? Yeah, it's weird. Uh, I, I think it's because it we're slightly more mature and like find different things funny. We're I guess. more mature, I so like we wouldn't have thought that was funny if we were like 22 when it came out. Um. No, we probably would have. <laughs> I don't know. So what's the answer, Zach? Well, I think that like we're more influenced by the internet and like finding stuff on the internet than like other people are. So like we kind of like develop differently. You're right. So dude. like I feel like when we were younger is when like like Step Brothers yeah. came out in like what eighth grade for us, seventh grade. I don't know something like that. Um. And like you don't really know what's that funny like you have like a little right. bit of funny stuff senses but, like, of humor's changed you kind of like sure. like i remember like my dad showed me Step Brothers. like he was just like yeah this is a i funny saw it with my dad that's weird yeah so like <laughs> dad, so dad bonding dude. like that kind that's of develops real, you a little bit that's a real dad moment right but there. then you know as you get older and we've seen so much shit on the internet now that right. it's like we've developed beyond that a lot of pretty, different brands of pretty of comedy. simple humor you're, for you're the most totally part right. yeah i feel like reddit still funny though in my opinion a little bit Step yeah, you know, it's got its moments. It's yeah, got of its course. Moments, dude. Well, it's like funny nostalgic, funny. Yeah. 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 I, th- yeah, I think Nighthawk. Reddit has like desensitized me to all humor except like ironic humor. Like, yeah. The only <laughs> thing I, the only thing I can appreciate now is like making fun of like normal jokes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's kind of a bad symptom. Norm Macdonald fucked me up too. Norm Macdonald's got such a weird brand of humor that. Yeah. He is weird. It's just like that's. I think that's funny and like his delivery. It's really made other strange. things funny to me. It is. It's really the way strange. he like just tells his jokes. Like is disoriented. I love it. <laughs> it really is. You're like, wait, that was the he punchline. Throws line? you off. <laughs> <laughs> I love his voice, dude. Too. Wish we could talk to Norm Macdonald. Norm, if you're listening, get on the podcast. God, <laughs> Come on the pod, Norm. Famous guests. You, you can say really something offensive on our podcast, please. <laughs> Yo, did we go through the whole pod with ne- and never do an official review of the sandwich we ate right before the oh, pod? Oh, shit. Yeah, actually, I want to get your guys' full review. Yeah, let's do it. I, I prepared, uh, I've been hyping it up, but I prepared uh, the boys' sandwich today. The Hunty um, fucking... The fresh sandwich. The, the fresh sandwich, the Hunty signature. Um, the classic. Oh, I think Zach dubbed it the Hunt Fresh Sig or something. <laughs> <laughs> Sig at the end? <laughs> The Sig, the signature. Oh, the good Sig. All right. Yeah, I, I think I called it like the Hunty Ridge. The oh, Hunty the Ridge. Oh, yeah, I love right, it. Right. Original. The, the Ridge. The Sig. <laughs> but yeah, man. Um, I won't reveal what what the ingredients are. It's a, it's a secret. Secret but, uh, recipe. Because you're gonna recipe. open a restaurant with it. Yeah, like that. you guys can't comp that. <laughs> uh, but you I want to get the official review from the boys right now. <laughs> it was good. It was dope. It was good. It was dope. What, I hadn't I, eaten anything, so do you it think was that's influencing your decision? Good. Yeah. 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 Okay. But um, also a thousand island dressing as a sauce. Sorry, I'm giving away the secret ingredient. Dude, fuck um, you. Leaked. Literally so good, and I'm gonna go to the store and buy a thousand island. Tomorrow. I'm glad you fucked with that. Dude. So. I'm glad you fucked. With that. That's the first, before I started making the sandwich. I'd never done that. It's good shit. Fuck with it. Oh, I thought you meant that was literally your first time. I was like, balls oh, no, no. <laughs> You're like, wait, what? This is your balls signature <laughs> and you haven't. I'm fucking with the new sauce, guys. <laughs> yeah, this is my first sandwich actually I've ever made. Mm. I was also. I'm starting today. I was also very hungry after work, so I'm pretty sure anything would have tasted good. But wow. it tasted really good. Wow. Thank you, guys. Well, I don't, I, I'll don't. i take those with a grain of salt. Um, no, no, no. <laughs> give me, let's get a number review. <laughs> I gotta think like review, bro. I'm uh, I'm gonna give it a eight out of ten. Wow. 
I mean, I've never been asked be to give an official review. If you this were to true. panini that sandwich, yeah, caramelize the onions. Ah, oh, dude, heat it Keep up. the pickle in there, he- but don't put up. the lettuce in there because grilled lettuce yeah, is yeah, disgusting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't want that. What do you put the lettuce in last? Uh, just don't put in just lettuce. Don't. No lettuce. Um, that was quality. But part all of the it. other ingredients I like and uh, caramelized onions instead of, and have it hot with the cheese melted. That would be a ten. Yeah, if it was hot. Fair enough. That would be Fair good. Enough. I would give it. The bacon was also was really, really good. Enjoyable. <laughs> I'll give it an eight. Gang, give it an eight. <laughs> you know what, man? Sixteen out of twenty eight, total. That's rate. pretty. That's pretty solid, dude. That's four off a goddamn perfect score. First time I made the sandwich, so. Yeah, yeah. Not only was the the presentation was great, the complexity was great. There's a lot of flavor profiles, a great range of flavor. A lot of elements. The bread was beautifully toasted. It was over- Did you like those pickles, Jackson? Overall, yeah. They they were really good in the sandwich. Gotta love pickles. Those sweet, sweet ones. Um, Are we done with sandwiches? Yeah, thanks for the Sandwich review. Guys. Over. Appreciate you. So I'm going camping next weekend. Ooh. Camping. Thursday Boom. to Sunday. Going up north, north? down east. <laughs> Wait, you're going to north the... and then down east? Or you're going north? I guess it's just north, right? I don't know. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking but, um, about? Everywhere I'm going to, east, like, huh? going to like Bangor. We're stopping through Bangor. We're not really like going there. I'm going to stop in Bangor. And uh, I'm going <laughs> to hit up the, and shit. I'm going to hit up the Chick-fil-A. Oh, I'm just right. gonna fuck up like two sandwiches while we're there, <laughs> <laughs> and then I think we're like spending the night in like Machias or some shit, and we have like a campsite Wait, what? that's like on the a beach night? for one night. Machias, Machias, dude. You never heard of Machias? What is that? A fucking? <laughs> that sounds like a preacher's son or something. That's sort of like there's... from the monk temples, dude. <laughs> Machias. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe you've never heard of Machias before. No, fuck. Why the fuck? No. I've lived here less time than you. <laughs> You've never yeah, met dude, someone I've, who's been like, oh, yeah, I'm from Machias. I've lived in southern Maine. I No, I've never heard of anyone from Machias. It's okay. Jeez, shout It'll out okay. to the Machias. If you guys are from Machias, comment down below. What the fuck? Smash that like. If Bar- <laughs> I'd say, like, if Bar Harbor is the Portland of Down East, Machias is, like, <laughs> the Saco of Down East. Mainers, dude. I okay. think that's, like, the comparison. I like Jackson's like, just shaking his head. Machias <laughs> is, like, a, like, from Ohio, dude. sizable town, but... That's about it. Stop yeah. talking up Machias, dude. All right, but so yeah. what are you doing on your cancer? Stop talking about so Machias. In Machias. <laughs> your new boyfriend, Machias. <laughs> I'm chilling with Machias this weekend, and uh, I think while we're in Machias, and I'm going to keep saying that word to piss you guys <laughs> off. Um, it's working. While we're in Machias, uh, we're going to stay on this beach called Machias Beach. I don't, I don't think that's what Makes it's called. That's not what it's called. But there's, yeah, I guess there's like a beach. Uh, that it's actually it, just called Beach. <laughs> it's either it's on the ocean um and there's just like you can just kind of wait the beach is on the ocean (laughs) yeah (laughs) the campground is the beach and the beach is on the ocean (laughs) so we're gonna camp on the ocean hopefully i'm all drowned dude you gotta count for that (laughs) imagine you wake up and the fucking like water is in your you just wake up and you got salt water and like starfish in your fucking tent oh no you're dead at the bottom of the ocean. There's a oh. tide. There's a tide pool in your tent. A you whole just, ecosystem has formed what while those, you fell what asleep. Are those wood, <laughs> what are those wood docks people put out in the in the water? Docks. Docks. No, dude. But there's like a thing for the ones. <laughs> there's a name for the ones you put out in the fucking and that that like the square that just floats. Oh, uh, okay. I know what you're talking about. You know what I'm I don't talking know what those about? are called. Not just a dock. Those are fun to a jump floating off, platform. Okay. You, yeah. okay. I don't know. Well, you know what I mean now. I don't even no, have to name it. It's a platform, it. yeah. You just camp out on one of those, set your tent up. That would be cool. That would be so hardcore, actually. Yeah, you'd wake up and just be seasick. Can you imagine it? Like, God, what am I sleeping on a boat? <laughs> I'm <laughs> basically, seasick. Basically, <laughs> you just sit, you feel bumps in the night from like sharks below you. Yeah, like the currents like pushing us. We're like, oh, oh my God. <laughs> Can you imagine like a storm coming? <laughs> you get fucking swiped out. <laughs> Yay! Late at night, just the fucking <laughs> tsunami-sized wave comes down. That almost you. happened to me one time. I was gonna go on a uh, canoe trip a couple years ago and ended up not being able to go. But um, because of the waves, I think I had like work or some shit. But what happened was, um, my other two friends who were going still went, and there was a storm, and they were on fresh water, but there was still like the water was super because of the wind. Yeah. The water was super disturbed. And they um, 
They said they like they said they pretty much capsized their canoe because he has like a pretty the canoe's uh, gunnels the walls were very well, of the gunnels, were very uh, shallow. Okay, shallow gunnels. So, so like <laughs> I respect their their canoe started getting I water respect. in it, but they were luckily close enough that they didn't have to like try and bail out. Like they just kind of like Damn, limped. Dude. That just you could be out. dead right They now. limped it to the island they were going to camp been, on. Yeah, you could have been if, dead if you, if you, if you were weighing down that canoe. Everyone, I would have capsized, everyone would bro. Everyone would have died. Mm-hmm. You would have yep. killed everybody on that I'm just glad I don't have to be there for that. And hopefully that doesn't happen on my camping trip this time. Yeah, so I was going to... You're no camping canoes. for four days. What are you going to do for four days on them in them woods? <laughs> Sorry, guys. Just cracked um, on that beach. Crap. Jack off. <laughs> all, <laughs> dude, what? All, all the usual. Well, so I'm only going to Machias in the woods, like, <laughs> for one day. Okay. <laughs> and then I'm going up north to uh, like Lubeck and Cutler, which are basically on the Canada border. They're on the coast of Maine on the Canada border. Tiny, like, fishing towns. There's, like, a shitty brewery in Lubeck, I guess. Fishing brewery. gang. Um, and then we're going to go to Acadia for a day, I think. And then the next day, I think I think we're going to Acadia on, like, Saturday. And then he thinks. Sleep there, and then on Sunday, drive home, I think, is the plan. It's a tour, dude. Uh, so wow, you're dude. Hitting the whole, like, the tour de force, everywhere. really. And so, uh, I'm ahead of miles on the lease, so I'm bringing the soup. Nice. nice. Zach, do you <laughs> riding in style? Do you do you have your own tent when you do this type of stuff? Um, I don't have my own tent. I actually don't have any camping stuff. Do you, <laughs> do you sleep in the suit? So, are, do you plan on masturbating? No. <laughs> <laughs> it's four days. I'll be I, okay. <laughs> have you <laughs> have you ever jerked off in the woods? Um, actually, o- on a leaf or something. <laughs> I had a tree house in middle school. <laughs> definitely jerked off in there. He's like, actually, there was like a the tree house. There was like a gap between the tree and the floor of the no. tree house. So you could just like you you suck your dick in the gap. The you didn't stick your dick through. You could just aim the the blast <laughs> through the hole. He spunks out you his get, fucking tree house old dude. I've been seeing a lot of good funny <laughs> memes. That's like when you realize no nut november is quickly <laughs> approaching no <laughs> yeah so that's this are is, you guys gonna accept the challenge yeah, this <laughs> is my this is my no nut november training camp yeah it's honestly. just uh you the see four if day you make weekend. it this long to go for the full month yeah <laughs> oh. oh my god Still are you guys enough. accepting the challenge <laughs> yeah um, sure i'll go no nut november Wait, we should just... start hitting the gym and not jerking off. God, we'd oh, be God. so alpha. Jeez. Just be fucking. Just we'd just get in fights. I know. I was gonna say that's probably <laughs> how just one beat of the us shit kill, out of each other. Each other. <laughs> we would just get like by the end totally. of the month, like just somebody in our house is dead. Like, yo, how's it going, dude? Punch each other in the face. Yo, what the Peace fuck out. did you say? God, dude. that'd be sick. We so, could turn into a streamer house. <laughs> no nut. No nut. November means just no no coming whatsoever. No nut. For all oh, no, not. I mean, I think we're big enough nerds that we can make an exception for sex because it's just so rare. <laughs> <laughs> you get a pass. I actually don't know how the rules works, but yeah, I would assume, yeah. No jerk November. No jerk November. God damn, dude. What a fucking task. If you guys do it, I'll do it. <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> really like, yeah, well, might as well try. I'm I'm gonna jerk off in <laughs> No, 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 no. Zach's it's like, my birthday. I gotta Zach, have my birthday. Zach's jerk. like November first. He's like This is this is the podcast challenge. This is the this is Joe Rogan's sober October. This is our goddamn no nut. <laughs> okay. okay. What if we take a pick at the beginning of November and Guys, it's just like do sex us? dolls count? <laughs> at the end of November it's Going like three Joe Rogans. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> We just turn into Joe Rogan because we don't jerk off for a month. <laughs> yeah. We're just bald and all five foot four. We all become like, like M- MMA experts. Just, pfft, just fucking juiced. Did you hear him? <laughs> we should start doing like uh, UFC reviews on the pod. That would get so many views if we threw those in the title. Yeah, we need to talk <laughs> we about more. We about need to talk about UFC. more current events. We, uh, we know absolutely nothing, but. Okay, but real quick. What who, what happens if we all do it? Or what happens at if one of us end, loses? At the end, we all jerk each other off. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, so hold on. That's are we just point. are we saying no coming whatsoever <laughs> for all of no, November? No jerk, no jerk. <laughs> no jerk. That's easy for you. You're gonna win. Hunter's talking to two single dudes trying to participate <laughs> in this challenge. Hey, single guys. I know you can't jerk off and sex is allowed, but... Sorry, Elizabeth. 
and I have to disallow it. <laughs> It's so you can't be a part of that. Okay. All right. All right. All right. You're not in this channel. So what happens? You can so be the moderator. I'll be the moderator. You got to give the reward. You have to set up cameras <laughs> over our beds <laughs> and like in the bathroom and stuff. Well, apparently I got to go to your treehouse In the too. toilet bowl. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Got to go back to my childhood it's, treehouse. It's, it's halfway Wait through a the second. month. Wait a out back building a treehouse. I'm like, what the fuck's <laughs> that kid doing? <laughs> I just come shoot from the fucking corner. <laughs> hey, wait a minute. <laughs> Wow, this tree sap is weird. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what I've Maple syrup myself season. <laughs> I like how He's we're just dying. I like how we're like at the end of Maple the pod almost, season. and we just never mention that we're in a totally different location. Oh yeah, yeah we're, at, up? we're at to Hunter's you, house. Coming to you live from Hunter's house. Pretty Welcome nice. to the crib, guys. Yeah, he made us sandwiches. It was great. We ah. reviewed the sandwiches. Hope you guys like Zach, it. Better. Zach and I were mentioning this. You walk into the place and you just instantly know it's a gamer's paradise, dude. Oh like, yeah, I'm glad you guys could recognize it. Center of the room, the gaming PC, man, all the <laughs> shit. Man. Ready to go, fired up. You fired can say Elizabeth absolutely loves that. Yeah, I mean, any gamer would. She goes, "Your desk is so fucking big." <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, "Yeah, I didn't realize it was gonna be that big." I got the large one. <laughs> it looks nice, dude. Honestly, it really uh, looks it's nice. Huge. Hey guys, guess what? <laughs> oh wow! Okay, dude, we're on fart iTunes. Mic. We're on iTunes. Oh, the it's fart fine. got dude, that's the fart be a got on the mic cover, Bruh <laughs> <laughs> You can smell it. Oh god! Remember earlier when we were like, "Dude, Step Brothers isn't funny." <laughs> it's still funny. <laughs> dude, we're so much past. We're so past that. We've elevated. We've matured, dude. dude we've matured as a culture since then. That's fucking hilarious. We live in a society now. All right, so up. real quick, just to end this. All right. No, no, not November for you boys. Winter gets a uh, um, quick handy. Winter gets dinner. It'll dry handy. It'll be, <laughs> really, it'll be really quick after the whole month. <laughs> dry. Winter gets dinner with Hunty. Uh, hold on, before we that's, that's uh, end the I podcast, think. I'm just looking at my thing here, and there's a bullet point that says, "Could you suck a cock?" Question mark. Oh yeah, that's. Are we addressing that this episode? Yeah, or are we saving that. that for next week? No, we can address it real okay. quick, right? Okay, What's yeah, we'll question? just we'll end, end it on this. Break, break it down. Could you so, suck yeah, a cock? I was, I was thinking about this. Maybe guys. for enough money. What do you guys? <laughs> could you guys suck on a suck on a cockus? Like, are you asking? Is there anything in the world that would make you suck a cock? So, let, like, okay, so let's say, because that seems easy. Let's say a situation. It's is not like, like if a guy is holding a gun to my head and he's like, "Suck my dick." I'm gonna be like, <laughs> "Nah, dude, I'm not fucking gay." <laughs> You're okay, gonna have so to kill me, bro. I guess it's like a money thing. <laughs> okay. Oh no 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 no. So no. how much money would you? No 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 no. This for? actually wasn't what I was thinking when I wrote this down. Okay, here's what I was actually thinking. Could you physically do it? Like what are the, like? Could you do put it in your fucking mouth? I imagine it's it honestly it pretty unpleasant. Uh yeah, right. It's how's, be awful. Like how's your gag reflex? That's the type of shit I'm wondering. Okay. Can you guys? I just that? can't imagine my dick tasting good. Of course, it doesn't taste good. <laughs> Of course it doesn't taste good. Clean your shit. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> clean your shit. I mean, oh. I clean it, but it's still a dick. You're it's right. A, a dick's right. a dick, dude. Let my nuts hang. You know? <laughs> but could you could you physically swallow a... Uh, you have to swallow a guy's load? Johnson? I, I mean, you I don't, don't know. swallow the... <laughs> sometimes, sometimes, I mean, like hot dogs and shit, I'm like... This has got to be pretty You're like, similar. is this a dick? <laughs> I thought you were going to say you practice or something. <laughs> sometimes on hot dogs, I shove it all out all the way back there. <laughs> that too. Dude, I feel it when I'm when I'm brushing my teeth, I goddamn gag. I I couldn't. Yeah, I don't I'm think brushing I have the back the, of my tongue. I'm like, that's eh. a good, that's I good don't finesse. have the oral finesse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't have it, dude. You get the oral you finesse. Would get there. <laughs> I'd get good at sucking dick. You ever sucked a dick, dude? Uh, Sunday school when I was young. <laughs> <laughs> he was so quick with that, dude. Holy shit! Just no. leaked on the pod. Catholic, by the way. <laughs> back in Sunday school. God, dude, that's fucking hilarious. All right, boys. Well, uh, my answer is no. I guess it sounds like you, you boys probably you couldn't, couldn't even figure this it out. This is the gayest I could podcast on the internet. <laughs> Listen, I could, I could. <laughs> We're gonna find out. I after couldn't the fit an entire one in there. All right, we'll that's all I'm out. saying. Gang, <laughs> <laughs> don't weird. make me be the only one who says that. <laughs> Wait, what'd you say? I was, I Nothing. was crossing out your bullet point. <laughs> Nothing. I didn't say that. What, what about you, Jack? <laughs> Are we done? I, no, I guess I'd do it for enough money. That's the consensus. So you could, you could handle it. Yeah, why not? Yeah, why not? Just if, I'm a, um, if I'm about to be hood rich, hood rich. I'm about to be hood rich. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah, I'll suck it. Or real rich. I don't know. 
I'll suck a big Peter. Would you do it for iPhone 6? For iPhone 6? <laughs> <laughs> Jackson's question in iPhone 6. Isn't that it's what a good value electronic. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that what Wayne says? <laughs> um, no, Will Wayne says for some truck fit. No way. He definitely has an iPhone related lyric, right? Will Wayne? I swear, right? My dick for an iPhone so 6. So in Don't Stop by French Montana, Will Wayne's in it. And he's like, stop Trip. talking that shit and suck a dude dick for some truck fit. That's what he says, which yeah. is a clothing brand. Okay. Clothing Jesus brand for Christ. men, I think. So I'm like, I don't know, what I don't know why for. she'd want truck fit, but Can't wait fits to do this well to my, in trucks. My boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to Face Unlock. It's so nice, dude. Face Unlock. Face Unlock, flex. baby boys. Thanks for tuning into the Lame Dudes podcast, folks. Yeah, nice even hour, folks. Episode 29, gang. Gang.